the circus is in Gilinor. Where is it? You will actually need to go to the compass icon. Want to mini games? Make sure mini games D and D list is set to all, and you will want to look for the circus. And make sure to teleport to Lodestone. And for more information, you'll go back up to it, and it'll say. You have completed zero out of six performances this week. And it will say where the vendor is currently located, which in my case is Taverly. And you can only do each activity once a week. And after completing the quest, some like a code, you have access to a thieving performance. After the fire maker's curse, you have performance for two fire making performances. And this is actually the best possible way to train your agility range and magic on a very fresh account so again this is learner friendly or fresh start worlds one more thing to note is that it does help a little bit to have a higher level in agility magic and range and because of that boost do help a little so you could use a Vecna scroll any overload of any type just higher the better tier and we'll be making our way to a little vendor if it's in an area that you are unaware of it will actually have this little icon right here the distractions and deviations it will be pretty much in the main cities of Gilinor so once we're there Speak to the ticket vendor by just clicking on it. You can also do the scoreboard, which I will be going over later in this episode, in the video, on how to go for the max points. First off, when you're here, you may get a little cutscene, and then you'll have the remaster. If you have done this before and you are going for max points, right click on rewards and hit option. Yes, you're here for replacements. You want to get the best possible outfit that you do have before you're doing performances as the outfit does impact your score. I'm not sure about the items, although it may help. I just know for the outfit. I'm not sure about the other pieces. So wear that if you want the best possible points you can get i'll be doing agility for now which is just right here at the changing room and again you can do this at level one in all your skills you may need to speak to the agility assistant before he automatically starts and while you're here you can wait a little bit and hopefully the audience can tells you they say come on do something in which case you want to do a small hop, and it will indicate which one you have successfully completed. And you could wait again, do a lay balance. You will only get experience for one thing that you have successfully completed. And in the background, how they just said juggle with the cannibals. You want to juggle, go to cannibals. And then it will make the audience. Ooh, ah. Now they say juggle speeds, which we will do. Following what the audience says will give you a higher score. And if you're just going for experience, you want to actually do each action at least once. So no repeats unless you fail it. Then you keep doing that one trick until you do pass it. And you only have a total of 10 actions you're able to do. Like right there, I slipped. So I can still do number 60. Now I will get the XP drop. And I believe this is my 10th one when I do the cartwheel. Oh, okay, guess not. There we go. It will tell you what your score was and how much agility experience you got. Keep in mind, this is not affected by bonus experience or double XP. 
In my case, I got 13,000 agility experience. This is one of the ways how I was able to get 19 agility pretty much within two days of making the account. Because you can do the circus every Wednesday. It resets on that day. So now here's for the range. So speak to the range assistant. And these are very hard to click on, so you may need to zoom in. And I'm going to be honest, the target, it's best with the bow and arrow. And then you just keep moving forward. One thing to note is that for whatever reason, the range performance, you have the absolute lowest chance of succeeding. So you won't expect to get too much range levels. Once you have shot all five and you're up to the 50%. It's time to go to the shooting spot with the ducks and for here you'll just use the bow it's extremely quick for this one i got 539 score with almost 20,000 range experience now Time to go over how to get the ringmaster, which you will need a score of 1250 or higher. So for that, you don't want to do the low level ones as they're indicated, it says approximately level 50. You will want to do the 99 option. And for this one, just speak to the assistant and she'll teach you. And the anvil is what you want to do. So pot up by any means necessary where your best performance goes from the ringmaster. And before we do anything, let's do an emote. So let's do yes. Right click cast alchemy on the anvil. And we succeeded. Now that we have done that, let's do no now. And now right click teleport and the audience is saying to teleport something. So right there, we got bonus score for that. And they said blast this book. So we'll still do it, even though you're supposed to just do 99 forever. So let's bow, blast the book. And see how that only gave me like 30 points. That is why you just want to focus on the level 99 alchemy so now we will think teleport and you'll want to keep alternating between alchemy and teleport because you won't get rewarded for doing the same act twice in a row so let's do another emote teleport let's cheer Okay. Let's jump for joy. Teleport to Anvil. We shall dance. We will Alkit. And I don't know if this will be the last time I'll be able to do it. Okay, we can still do it again. So, dance. It doesn't matter what emote you do. Just don't do anything like beckon or anger, as that will be kind of bad. And now, let's blow a kiss for the honors for some good luck. And out. Out the stool. I forgot which one I went to, but it does help to pay attention to that. I remember the goal is to get 1250 in which case i got 1239 as my magic performance and that is because i did the book because i only got 30 out of that and i did fail one of the anvil you could get a max of like 1400 so you do have room for failing once or twice and you shall still get it And then once you have done the sum like a cold, 
you do have access to the fire making one, which is right here and here. And you also have access to the agility one. But if you wish to exit, click on the circuits ticket and you will be free with that. Thank you all so much for watching this ultimate guide on the circus on both how to do this for experience on a new account to power level your range, magic, and agility, or how to get the ringmaster by getting the 1250 performance with that. Thank you all so much for watching and enjoy the rest of your day. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment as it really does help.